What's going on gamers? It's Fox2 and today I am bringing you another, yes another, hardpoint shutout. This time on Raid and this is actually in the Mosh Pit League Play Platinum Division I believe is where we're at right now. So League Play, you know, Platinum Division of the Mosh Pit, not quite as high of competition as it is in the Championship Series, but either way it's a shutout. Um, unfortunately, in this gameplay, the gameplay actually gets cut off. The video gets cut off when we're like 211 to 0. But trust me, I'm being honest. We finished it out 250 to nothing. So I'm going to go ahead and make the video. Basically, because I wanted to talk about theater mode. Theater mode in this, in this particular video kind of screwed me up. It kind of dicked me because... When the people kept backing out of the game, it changed host and that cut off the video. So it just shows, at the end you'll see it just goes to buffering and gives us the little Treyarch symbol. But what I want to talk about is theater mode. And the fact that it's been confirmed that theater mode will not exist in Call of Duty Ghosts. I think this is a mistake. There's a lot of different opinions on it. The next-gen consoles, both of them are going to have built-in PVR recording software. But the, the recording software and hardware that come with the next-gen consoles are going to have time constraints, size constraints, things like that. I personally probably will not use them. I might fill around with it a little bit, but I will probably still either use my HD PVR that I use now or possibly switch over to either an Avermedia game capture card or an Elgato. Um, we'll see how, you know, we'll see how things go, but I will definitely be posting gameplays on the next-gen console PS4 for you guys at the best possible quality that I can. So I, I really think that, I, I really think Activision is making a big mistake by leaving out theater mode because it's been something that's been a staple in the Call of Duty series for the last three years straight now, and it's been incredibly popular. Even people that don't have YouTube channels that aren't, you know, YouTube commentators and things like that really enjoy being able to go in and edit their clips and save them to their theater uh, theater mode so that their friends can go and check them out or they can invite friends over and say, hey, you know, check out this six-man feed that I got. Check out, you know, this. Check out that. Whatever it, it might be. I really think that Activision needs to take a quick look at the demographic that they're serving most people that play call of duty don't upload videos to youtube don't stream live to twitch things like that so taking away the theater mode is going to negatively affect more people than it will positively affect people in the fact that they have the pvr capability with the next gen consoles so I don't know. Everybody's gonna have their own opinion on this. Let me know what you guys think uh, in the comment section. I know the gameplay that you guys are watching right now is not super exciting, but it is a shutout gameplay, and I'm trying to get one on every single map of the game, just like I said I was gonna do. So here in just a second, you're gonna see where it completely just cuts off at like 211 to nothing. But if you guys like the video, leave a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Make sure you click that subscribe button. And as, oh, Vonderhaar. And as always, have a great day, guys.